What is up, party people? How you doing? You good? Good. If you not, have your time, but get good. So, today I wanted to talk about the Divine Feminine. Now, everyone has their own definition of the Divine Feminine. However, mine, personally, is someone who knows herself and truly embraces herself. Regardless of who is around, she is who she is, she likes what she likes, this is how she dresses, this is how she doesn't dress, this is how she speaks, this is what she thinks, this she is, she just embraces herself with everything. I'm working on my Divine Feminine. I'm also working on my Divine Masculine. So, um, the Divine Feminine is an interesting journey. Hopefully you guys look into it. Um, I have embraced myself and who I am and I want you guys to do the same because you have to love yourself in order to love others. Teach people through your journey. Don't just talk about it, be about it. But Divine Feminine, let's work towards it together. Everyone, male and female, men have feminine and women have masculine. Um, energies. Everyone has everything. You are polarized. You are whole. You are not just masculine. You are feminine. You're not just feminine. You're masculine. You have to balance yourself. This is why I tell you guys to balance yourself so much. But like I said, divine feminine. So embrace your intuit intuition. Yes. Embrace your intuition and yourself. And you'll definitely get on the journey of embracing your divine feminine so good luck you guys i love you peace